Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you how I clip in my hair extensions and get these really soft, pretty waves. So I am using Irresistible Me hair extensions. Um, these extensions are bomb. I've been using them for about two, three years now. They are incredible. They're Remy human hairs. So you can curl them, straighten them, wash them, crimp them, whatever you want to do with them. So basically this is the signature weft. Um, it has four clips. It's really thick. And if you have thinner hair, you could probably get away with just using the signature weft. They do sell it separately. But this is my favorite part about the whole extension because it makes putting them in so much faster. And it looks so much better because it's so thick. These are the Royal Medium Brown number 4 and I got these in 24 inches. At first I thought they were like too long but then when I curled them I, I absolutely just loved how they looked. And also these are the 200 grams because I do feel like I have thicker hair so um, I just really wanted to make sure that it wasn't going to be too thin for my hair. I just wanted to make sure that it was a thick extension. Also if you would like 20% off these extensions my code is get 20 off. I'm going to put it in the description box. These are the best extensions that I've ever tried. I have tried a bunch of different ones but I always always come back to these um, just because they last so long too. I, ha I actually have three of them in three different colors. I have a brunette, I have a blonde, and then I also have a dark um, plum. And you can also dye them also if they don't match your hair. So that's really really awesome. So I'm going to be showing you guys how I clip these bad boys in and style. So if you like to see, then just keep watching. Okay, so this is three-day hair for me. My hair is naturally curly, so I straightened it and then kind of left it a little wavy, so it looks like a mess right now. Before I put my extensions in, I just want to refresh it, make it look a lot cleaner. Yeah, then I can clip the extensions in because right now it's just looking like a hot mess. So I'm going to be taking my Batiste uh, dry shampoo, I think that's how you say it, in the scent blush. And I'm just going to part my hair, spray this bad boy on, and then just rub it. This stuff is honestly so good. I know so many people talk about this one, but it's just honestly really good. It's one of the best dry shampoos I've ever used. So I basically just part it randomly. And then rub it in and it just gets like that fresh clean look recently I've been parting my hair on the side so I'm just gonna spray again on the side and on the back just to make sure nothing looks oily then I'm just going to brush that through also it just looks so much cleaner after I spray that and that's why I love that stuff because um, I don't have to wash my hair every you know day or every two days. I can go a little bit longer but it, it won't be dirty looking or smell dirty or anything like that so I love that dry shampoo. So the first thing that I'm going to be doing is just taking my thumbs and I'm just going to be sectioning off this section right here. I just go right above my ears. Where probably right by my ears and I just make this into a little section, a little bun and then I just take a clip and clip that bad boy up. So now I just have the bottom layer of my hair. So this is where I clip in my signature weft. I'm just gonna clip that in. And these extensions are so comfortable to wear. I've worn ones that they hurt my head and they just feel so heavy and I just can't stand them. Okay, so I just clipped in that section. I had to move the camera down a little bit to show you how long these bad boys are. They're super, super long. So after I take that whole section down, I'm just going to section it one more time. Kind of go right by my temples. Then I'm going to be taking the two clip wefts and I'm just going to be placing those right there. I'm going to do the same thing on this side. Then I'm going to take down the whole thing. Then I have one clip wefts and I actually like clipping these in at the end to see where I feel like I need more blending. I'll either clip them in right over here, just so right 
underneath my hair blends better or I will clip them in by my ear. But I do like these closer to my face just to make sure everything blends. To curl my hair, I'm going to be taking the Chi Curling Iron. I've had this for a while and I actually really like it. So just going to curl my hair. Um, I curl some pieces with the extension and then I curl some of them with no extension, just my hair. Because I feel like it gives more volume if I do some of them separately. But I just find any pieces that have to have some curl and I curl it different directions. Sometimes I don't even go all the way through with my hair. I'll just kind of find certain pieces that need a little bit of a wave and I'll just wave it. take the bangs or the front pieces of my hair and I turn the curling iron upside down and I just kind of swoop it back and give it a nice little no, swoop. <laughs> so I like to play around with where to place the one wafts. I actually feel like I'm going to like it down here better. Yep, there we go. Better. Sometimes I will take the extension and my hair together. curl it together. I'm going to take the other one left and pop him in right down here also. And then sometimes I'll put this behind my ear. This is the finished look. I feel like I just feel so like effortless with this. Um, I love my hair long and wavy like this. So this is what it looks like. I can play around with it kind of have it however I want, behind my ear, not behind my ear, and yeah. It's not even take me a long time at all to put it in and style it. I feel like it takes me maybe 15 minutes, and I'm obsessed with how it looks. Like it So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video.